Well, it's nearly 33 degrees, 78 percent humidity. <laughs> I'll be so glad when summer is over. <clears throat> but we're going for a walk anyway. In beautiful sunny Mazatlan. Turn off this fan. Please make sure I have my cigarettes. Yeah, yeah, we're all great. <clears throat> I'm just going to get down. Oh, what happened there? Jeez. It said it went into sleep mode. I've never seen that before. I went into sleep mode last night about 7.30. Oh, a long day yesterday. <coughs> I guess more accurately, what a long day Sunday. Linda and I went out to the Olympia and came back to the house and had a lot of fun. Man, I was suffering yesterday. <coughs> I don't usually get hungover, but there are exceptions to every rule. I like this little alleyway down here. Let's see if I can zoom in. Yeah, so when Glenda came over the other day, holy moly, she cleaned the whole house inside and out. And she even weeded the weeds out of the cracks in my sidewalk and, and the neighbor's sidewalk as well and cleaned up the whole place. And it just looks spectacular when she was done. And she made a lunch for us. It's great having her around. Hope to see her again later today. I see a lot of people have been watching the videos with her in them. That's good. Hello, Vigo. How are you doing? All right, you? Good, good. You're good. You feel better in your stomach? Much better today. Yeah, all my person work? Doing work. Yeah, I was... Before you drink the, the, the other one, drink, drink, drink the other person too. I'm going to, yeah. <laughs> all right, talk to you later. He's a good guy. He just lives just up the street from me. All right, he came by yesterday and he said, hey, how you doing? I said, you know, to be honest, I'm not feeling that good. So uh, anyway, I survived it. And uh, after eight and a half hours sleep and a good big breakfast this morning, including a ham steak, my neighbor from, uh, I believe he lives in Long Beach. He and his wife come here for six weeks, two months every year, and they stay in the house beside me in one of the apartments over there. And a very nice guy. And he brought me some really fancy ravioli with mushroom fillings and a uh, beautiful piece of ham steak or cooked ham. I just fried some up in the pan this morning. Had some mashed potatoes and gravy with it. <clears throat> now I feel like a million bucks.
<laughs> Ooh. It's the problem with walking this time of day, like around noon hour in the summer. Not much shade anywhere. It's warm. <clears throat> Beautiful flowers. Oh, it's nice. So I get up this morning, five o'clock, no, four o'clock. Go have a pee. Mouse has got about 20 feet of this uh, invasive vine that's growing all over the place across the street <clears throat> on the bathroom floor and a big dead rat. And he's sitting there on the bathroom floor and he didn't want to leave. I don't know if he thought his rat was going to come back to life or what. Anyway, so that was my first task this morning. Clean that mess up. The joys of having cats. And of course he's very proud because he got you something. I get the green, white, and red all flying here. I don't know if Flag Day's coming up soon. I think maybe it is. Maybe it's Mexican Independence Day. I'm not sure. Good Lord, that one block, that's the third time a car's come up behind me and the, none of them go by you, they sit behind you and you're like, what are they doing? Well, I hope to be able to make a lot more walking videos here in the near future once it cools off a bit. These are just uncomfortable to get out and walk. It's, I had to go to town today, so I said, right, I'll do one.
Now my plan is just to go up here to Santander Bank, and that's it. Head back home. Every freaking car in Mazatlan. Well, Santander's just across the street there. I'm going to use one of these conveniently placed window ledges to take my camera apart. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye for now.